Okay, so this should be the, uh, let me get, let me get like normal lighting here. Uh, this should be the day this thing actually moves on its own power. We're going to bleed out the brakes and make sure nothing leaks. And we're going to get it actually running with the carburetor already rebuilt. So we'll uh, work on that. But yeah, after many, many months, we're actually going to have this thing Rock and rolling on its own power. You know, comment below if you have, if you, uh, if it, you know, any, any tips or help. And if you've done this yourself, anything, I would appreciate all of it. And I really hope that you enjoyed me reviving this beast. All right. Let's get to it. You buy something, you, so when you buy something universal, because this, I'm at the, like, the last stages here. You, you would think that the hole that they made for the stud would be right. Well, lo and behold, no. It's a little too small. And of course, uh, of course, I didn't bring any drill bits. So, this is the fun and games I'm going to do to get this running. Or driving. You gotta take this, put a screwdriver in there, and whittle away. Because I didn't bring a drill, because oh, I don't need a drill. I can leave, I'm fine. I can just leave that home and all my drill bits that are sitting right there on the bench. I don't need those. So, yeah, so when you don't have a drill and you need to make a metal hole a little bigger. And I have nothing mechanical to do this with. So, this is the way it's going to be. All right, hopefully I'll get through. A few moments later. It's hot. Well, that's good. That means it actually did something. All right, let's see. It's on. Hey, look, it's on. It worked. All right. Well, there's some, uh, there's some engineering for you. Yep. When you're a mechanic, you just make stuff work. Great stuff, huh? I guess this would be, uh, this would be redneck, redneck drill bit, right? All right, we're gonna, we're gonna light this candle and see what happens. Then we're gonna give her go for a ride. So let me get my uh, my voltmeter and make sure this thing's charging. to light this candle yeah. say a prayer to it's a weird gas pedal but okay She's running. She is running. She is not charging. Good. 
Oh, that's not good. Ooh, that was not good. The battery's not charging, which is kind of bad. Smells very rich. It's running much worse than it was when I did an initial initial. So let me pull this off. Maybe that is bad. It almost feels like it has a vacuum leak. It almost feels like a, a giant vacuum leak. Oh, here it is. Uh, that one's brighter. All right, let's let's give this a whirl then, see if that makes a difference. I hate them, I hate them, I hate them. I hate hollies. I freaking hate them. With all my might, I hate hollies. This is why hollies are, are garbage for street cars. If this was an Edelbrock on this car, it would be running already. I wouldn't even be, I wouldn't even be having to do anything. It would be already down the road. But because this is a holly, this is what happens. They leak like sieves. That, that's, their, that's, why they, that's why they keep selling these kits. Because they can make so much money just keep on selling the same damn kit over and over again. Yeah, if this was an Edelbrock, we'd already be driving down the road. One hundred, one hundred percent. If this was an L Brock, we'd be driving down the road already. Okay, we'll try this one more time.
Here goes. Oh, here goes nothing. We're gonna we're gonna drive this around the fucking lot. So we will see. I gotta get these they have barriers in the way. So you it's running. Well, we'll, we'll see. Let's see if we even have brakes. I know we don't have, the gas pedal is wacky. All right, here goes nothing, I guess. This thing hasn't moved since the Trump administration. Yeah. This is going to be interesting. Interesting to say the least. Ooh. All right. Oh, wow. I can't get the seat to lock in place. That's dangerous. All right. I feel like I have brakes. All right. Oh, wow. That's that sucks. All right, I'm in drive. All right, here we go. The brakes seem to stop me. All right. Now, it's in drive. It is driving. Oh, oops. They just aren't looking. It stopped. I don't know, maybe a little high, but oh, I love the speedometer in this thing. That is so freaky. All right, so I'm using. All right, so we're we're driving here. We're driving the uh, Toronado. First time since I don't know before the. I, I think it was the Trump administration. Like literally, that's how long ago this thing's been going. And uh, we're going around the. Uh, It's moving under its own power. This thing's a boat. It is an utter and absolute boat. We are, but we are rocking and rolling. All right, she now is a runner and a driver. My camera overheated while we're going around and around about three times. She's leaking oil, but it's running. I think it needs a tune-up. I think the plugs are messed in this thing. But there you go. Put this over here. I think the sun and everything has just made this. Uh... All right. So there is the uh, hardest part of this entire process has been completed. The... Uh, the car is running and it will move under its own power and it actually has brakes. I was actually able to stop the car. Somebody pulled out in front of me and I actually stopped the car. I was quite, quite enthused. So um, we are making a great progress here. Next, we're going to just do all the real brakes and probably figure out, get tuned a little bit more so it actually runs a little smoother. Figure out what's going on there and figure out what this oil leak is. But, you know, this has been a lot of hours in the incredible sun of Florida. And so now it's a car again that, ride, that starts and runs. I also got to find out why it's not charging. It doesn't seem like it's charging. So I think the alternator may be bad. 
that's another thing. But nevertheless, it runs. So I hope you got something from this. I hope you enjoyed it. You know, if you did, hit like. You know, if really subscribe. That'll help me out. It helps the algorithm because you subscribe to my channel, you get more channels like my channel in your feed. So you get to see more and more car stuff. Isn't it great how the life works? So as always, you know, comment. And if you have an old car like this thing, take it out. Make someone's day. It may even be your own. And I'll catch you down the road.